fancy a fun paper that we're going to do today for our numbers lesson today. We are going to write the let oh the number the number what? Six. Oh, the number six. I can see some of you are having your eyes right here. How do I know it's number six? Because it has a Good, you are remembering it has a ball at the bottom. Let's count the apples. Begin. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mm, those look juicy. We're going to color them today and we're going to make the number six. The number six starts on a red dot. We slay it all the way down to the... Oh, it's my turn. My turn. We slant all the way down to the pink carpet and go up and tuck in, making our ball when we make number six. It's going to look like a nice paper today. I know you're going to do your best. Let's look at it over here. Let me grab my chalk real quick. And it starts on a red dot. I'm going to go so slow. And I'm going to slant down, all the way down to the bottom. I'm going to curve around and tuck in just like that. Whoa, are you gonna be able to tuck in today? Watch Mrs. Stewart, are you gonna be able to go down, all the way down, and then come around and tuck in when you make your very own? I hope so, I think you can do it. Class stamp, let's go ahead and tuck into the table. The boys and girls here already have their papers in their desk and you go ahead and prepare for this fun paper. See, he's all ready. Oh, my! I like how you're waiting so patiently. Go ahead, Connor, your friends are in. Take out your paper. your pencil pencil check I like how Lauren had her eyes right on mrs. Stewart I like how Joseph has his helper hand in the corner so does Catherine Lucia has her eyes on me boys and girls watching you are ready nice way to go daddy says <laughs> mommy says I love you. the baby say Great job. I just showed you before, but I'm going to show you again on the blue box. Your eyes are right here on me. I start on the red dot. I'm going to slant all the way down to the bottom. I'm going to curve around to make my ball and tuck in. Go to the blue box. Go to the blue box. Begin. Slant down. All the way down to the bottom. Curve around to make your ball and tuck in. Oh, I hope you're going slow, Connor. Go real slow so you stay right on the line. I hope you're gonna do your best on this paper. Do your very best on each one, not just the last one, but on each one. Watch me, your pencils and pencil rest on a juicy red apple. And eyes this way. I start at the red dot. I'm gonna curve down to the bottom. I'm gonna curve around to make my ball, and I tuck in. Go to the orange box. Make this one so slow. Begin. Start at the red dot. Go down to the bottom. Curve around. And tuck in. Pencil rest on the teacher card. Nice. Oh, no teacher card. Pencil rest on a green apple. Let's pencil rest on a green apple. And we're going to go to the green box. Watch me. I start at the red dot. My helper hands in the corner. My mommy and daddy are holding on tight. And I'm going to go down. I curve around to make my ball. And I tuck in. Oh, that's my best one yet. I'm going to do my very best. Go to the green box. Put your pencil on the green box. Begin. Slant down. Oh, I like how slow we're going. Curve around, make your ball, and tuck in. Nice. Pencil rest on a red apple. 
Pencil rest on a red apple. Oh, Johanna, that was so fast with your eyes. Way to go. I'm on my purple box. I start at the red dot. I go down. I curve around to make my ball. And then I tuck in. Go to the purple box. I start at the red dot. I slant all the way down. I curve around and I tuck in. Very nice. Pencil rest on a green apple. And eyes on me. We're going to make our very own. Watch me. I'm going to slant all the way down until I get to that box and I'm going to start to curve. And then I make my ball and I tuck in. Do you see where my ball is? My ball is way down here. So I slanted down and then I started to curve around and I tuck in. Go ahead and go to the yellow box. Put your pencil on the yellow box. Here we go. Make this one your very best. Slant down. Curve at the bottom. And tuck in as you make your ball. Wow, I'm gonna have to show the boys and girls this girl's paper right here. We're working on staying on the lines, but her purple box, you can tell she really worked hard on it and her yellow box. Look at that. Very nice. She's working on it. Good job, Johanna. Nice work. Pencils to bed. Take out your crayons, put them on your name tag. I think we could do that a little bit quieter. Go ahead and put your crayons back in your bed. Take out your pencils. Let's try this a little bit quieter. Your pencil is in your hand still. Help her hand in that corner. Oh, it shouldn't take you that long to get your pencil out. We just put them away. Now, wait for the teacher's instructions to put your pencil away. Connor, are you waiting? Pencils to bed, quietly, and take out your crayons. Much quieter, thank you. Much better. Now, I do see those juicy red and green apples. I want them to stay that way. I want them to still look juicy and red and green. So the first thing I'm going to do is, I'm going to take my red crayon, and I'm gonna do all of my red apples first. So eyes on me so you can see all of my red apples. When I color, I'm gonna color, hmm. Somebody does not have their hands in their lap. Eyes this way so you can see. I'm going to color so neatly so that I don't get red outside my apple, so that I don't get red on my green apples because I don't want greenish red apples. I want red and green apples. So I'm taking my time and I'm coloring so neatly. Oh, I like how I looked and I saw some eyes glued on me. I'm giving you a wink, good job. And I'm coloring in just my red apples. Take out your red crayon, red crayon check. Good. Daddy says? <laughs> Mommy says? <laughs> the baby say? <laughs> Go ahead and color your paper, the apples. <coughs> Do a good job. Color neatly. Luke, I think it's on the floor. Go ahead and pick it up.
take your time. We have lots of time. Make it so pretty. God made these beautiful apples, so we want to take our time. Make them pretty. Elisha, where do the apples grow? On a what? How do I get them? I pick them from a what? Do you know? Bethany, where do I pick an apple from? Tree. Yes, from an apple tree, yes. I pick them right off an apple tree. Or sometimes I can go to the grocery store and get them. Oh, don't do that yet. We're only coloring the red ones. Just color the red apples. Stay with the teacher. We're only coloring the red apples right now. Stay with the teacher. Just color all the red apples. I love, look at over here. Very nice, look at these pretty papers. Oh, good job, William. That looks so nice, staying inside the lines. Nice job, good job, Joseph. I see that you're staying inside those lines. Way to go. Mm -hmm. Help me say my, our apple poem. Way up high in the apple tree, two little apples smiled at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could. Down came the apples. Mmm, they were good. Take a great big bite. Mmm, they're so yummy, aren't they? Yep. Oh, I like how he's picking one right off of his bowl right there. Good job, Joseph. That is fun. Way to go. Nice work. All right, I'll give you just a second or two more to finish your red apples. How are you doing, boys and girls watching? Did you finish coloring your red apples? Are they nice and neat? Good, good. We are improving every day. I love these red apples right here. I think this table should show the boys and girls watching their papers. Can you show the boys and girls watching their paper? Just table two. They are so nice and neat. Look at those apple papers. Way to go. Okay, put them down. I'll we'll buy your green crayon. All right, red crayons down and hands in your lap. And eyes this way. Now I'm going to color just my green apples. So I'm gonna do just as nice. I am taking my time. Look at that, I'm not rushing it. I don't have to rush it. I can do a, such a pretty job. I'm not scribbling, I'm not drawing on them. I'm just going back and forth and back and forth making those apples so pretty and juicy. Oh, it looks just like a beautiful painting. I love it. Take out your green crayon, green crayon check. Go ahead and color your green apples. Now I see red apples and I see green apples on your plate or your bowl, but God also made another color. Don't yell out at me. Let me see if I could pick somebody who could tell me. Hmm. Joseph, do you know what the other color is? Green. Well, there's green and there's red. What's the other color? Yellow. Yes, there's those yummy yellow kind. Mm hmm. Those are juicy. And there's all kinds of fun things we can make with our apples. Hmm. If you brought this whole big bowl of apples home, what could we make with our apples? Johanna, what could we make with our apples? Food. Yeah, what kind of apple food? Like a apple raisin bread. Oh, apple raisin bread. That would be good. Apple raisin bread. That would be delicious. Angelina, could you think of something we could do with those apples? Apple pie, that would be delicious. A yummy apple pie. Oh, you know what's really yummy is when you take the green ones, those like Granny Smith kind, and you make pie with those. Oh, they're so good. Mix it with cinnamon and sugar. Mm, 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 mm. So delicious. I like that. What else could we make, Kayla? Cookies. 
apple cider. Oh, apple cider. Do you like apple cider? I've got two bottles of it at home. In you do? Drink. Wow, that is yummy. I have applesauce at my home. And applesauce too? Mm -hmm. Applesauce is yummy. When you're eating your pork chops and you eat it with applesauce, that's yummy. Or just for a snack. Applesauce is yummy for a snack too. Mm -hmm. You're doing a good job. I see some beautiful apples. I like these green apples and these red apples. Keep coloring. Make it pretty. We're almost finished. Okay. How many apples were in our bowl, Lauren? How many? Mm -hmm. How many? Six. Six. There are six apples in our bowl. Yep. How many green apples are in our bowl, Mila? Do you know how many green apples are in there? Six. Not green. Mm -mm. How many green apples? Look at your bowl and count them. They're just the green ones. Three. Three. Good. There you go. And how many red apples are in there, Kyla? Just the red ones. Three. Three. Mm -hmm. And three plus three is six. How about that? So fun. Boys and girls watching, show me your paper. Table two showed us yours, or showed them yours. Let me see your paper. Beautiful. Those look delicious. You can make some yummy things with those. Oh, put your paper down. You already showed them yours. Good job. They're showing us theirs. Didn't they do a good job? They did. They did a pretty job. I like it. Let's see this table. Oh, uh, this table right here, can you show your friends your paper? Hold it up really nice. Look at those papers. They did a good job. Johanna, turn it that way so that your friends can see it. Can you turn this way? There you go. Now we got it. Good. Oh, you did such a good job. I like it. Way to go. <laughs> nice work. What number did we write today? Six. six. And six has a ball where? At the bottom. At the bottom. You are getting so good at this number. You know it so well. Go ahead and close up your crayon boxes. Slide them inside your desk. Slide your paper neatly inside of your desk. And maybe today you could take your paper home and put it on the refrigerator or hang it up in your bedroom or somewhere. Or mommy could take those apples and make something delicious with them. They look so good. I hope you're gonna work hard today. Class, Dan, turn your chair to the front and let's do our apple poem one more time. We'll stand up to do it this time. Are we ready? Good. Kyla, put your paper in your desk so we could do our poem. Oh, stand up big and tall for me. I see those trees way up there, and they are some juicy apples up there. Here we go. Way up high in the apple tree, two little apples smiled at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could. Down came the apples. Mmm, they were good. Oh, take that. Take another bite. Throw it for Frisky Whiskey. He's going to get it. Good job. You may be seated. Keep working hard. That was so fun today to color those beautiful apples. And I hope you keep working with your numbers.